Hi Adrian, the bee farmer here with Ecrotech Beekeeping Supplies, bringing you a short video on how to light a smoker and some different options. So today what I have is a bottle of water, a pump bottle, a bit of sugarcane mulch and some pine needles and also bee smoker liquid smoke. A stainless steel bucket and a dead aunt bee smoker. So to start off, you light a little bit of newspaper or get a little bit of fire, a bit of paper going in the bottom. I'm going to give it a few puffs. After it's going, add a little bit of pine needles, but you don't want to add too many at this stage. You want to get a fire going in the bottom and get it going nice and hot. As it gets hot and you see the flame come out the end of your smoker, you want to add a bit more fuel. Once it's well lit, I add enough fuel to make sure that there's no hot smoke coming out of the smoker. You want a nice cool smoke passing through the material. I'm using pine needles, which is my preference. Sugar cane mulch does work, but it's harder to stay lit. As you can see, I'm packing quite a lot of material on top. So there we go, our smoke is lit, we've got a hot fire in the bottom, the smoke has to pass through a lot of cool material, and I'm going to test it on my hand to make sure it's nice and cool. If you blow hot smoke on bees, it aggravates them and it's usually worse than not using a smoker at all. To open and close your bee smoker, simply use your hive tool, stop the burning fingers, and I like to carry it in a stainless steel bucket just to prevent fires and things like that. It's also handy for extinguishing your smoker. You can open the smoker up, put all your material into the bucket. And then I keep a bottle of water handy to make sure it's all out. Another option I spoke about is liquid bee smoke. It's a new product out and after the bushfires last season, I think it's a great product that is well worth trialling. So all I've done is put a litre of water into this spray bottle, squeeze the liquid smoke into there, give it a shake, and we're just going to spray it on the bees with a nice mist, the same as you would use a bee smoker. Thanks for watching this short video, and please subscribe to Ecrotech Beekeeping.